Hi, my name is Timothy Lemoyne and welcome back to my channel. This is part eight of building the one board birdhouse. In this video, it's all about no glue. This is the door. It's a short video. You're putting in the door to your birdhouse, one you're gonna have to get into and go out of and clean out and nest, eavesdrop on what the birds are doing. No glue in this space, very, very important. Stay tuned for more info. So as I mentioned a moment ago, you will have no glue on your door. It also gets less screws in it. So like if we look at my birdhouse so far, here's the front, here's the other side. There's a screw that goes in through this side. It's gonna help keep the birdhouse together. When you flip it around, this piece is gonna swing out. It's towards the camera right now. So there's screws on the top, those are gonna act like a hinge. There's screws that are gonna go on the bottom, those are gonna act like door locks, but otherwise, swings out. Watch this next scene to learn how to do it. So what I'm doing first here is just setting this guy in. We want this, this is the bottom side, over here is the top. And uh, what we wanna make sure we do is, when we drill all this together, we want flush right here. It's gonna make for the best looking birdhouse. I'm gonna slide this on the side, same kind of things are happening in here. Very important, have a kid hold for you when you are drilling so that this thing does not move around. I'm going full speed, just like I've shown you in the past. That's full speed for the pilot hole. Now when I sink a screw, this is when I call it feathering it in or do short little bursts on the trigger. So you get one in, make sure it's just below the surface of this piece of wood. Now I'm flipping around, and uh, I actually need to hold it left-handed, but uh, what's happening over there is I'm feeling to make sure that this remains flush, and I'm gonna drill in. But because I'm not ambidextrous, you're gonna have to not see what's happening on this far side. So that's that piece. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna squeeze everything up. You can see I actually gotta do quite a bit of persuading on this side. And again, things that are helpful when you have a friend. I'm gonna have to be creative here and just kinda push down on this guy. <laughs> So now I'm putting in screws in the bottom. These are the ones that I said act as a door lock. This one's lining up really nicely here. So this one I can just drill right in. And then this next part is gonna seem weird because you are gonna take these two bottom screws out. So you might say to yourself, well, why did you put them in, Lemoyne? Well, I put them in because I wanted everything pre-drilled. I actually wanted this dent here. I'm gonna end up replacing this screw later, much later, after painting with a different type of screw. One that's a little more common in most households. And I want to be able to see how does this open. I want to see how it functions. So as advertised, this is a super short video. It's all about that door and no glue. Little pro tip for you, before you set this aside for the day, leave the door cracked. That way if there's even the teeniest little drop of glue from something else in there, it will not dry shut. You'd be surprised how many kids end up in a wrestling match with this the next day. Leave it open to dry overnight. Thanks for tuning in. Click that like and subscribe button. Thank you much.